Hi everyone, this is Cheryl Allen. Welcome to Cheryl Allen's Empower Yourself. This is Miss Feisty. We're so glad that you're here. If it's your first time, please hit the red subscribe button below and become part of our tribe. We would love that. And today I'm gonna to be opening up Pop Sugar, which is one of my favorite boxes. Oh, it's one of my favorites. It's such a good one. You guys are gonna have fun with me. <laughs> um, so anyway, Today's message, I always give you a message. Today's message is, you know, we're all going to be let out soon. <laughs> I'm gonna say let out. <laughs> Some of us do feel like we've just been caged in. Um, personally, I have been out of the house a lot, every single day, multiple times, but it's for my job. Um, we're doing the coronavirus cleanings uh, at different, state buildings and um, stuff like that. So I have to go out and make sure everything's done right and it has to be, you know, to a very high standard. And I have to check on my guys and make sure that they're properly dressed and it's just a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff, <laughs> meetings and everything. Um, just wanna make sure that we take that job as responsible as possible because other people's lives depend on it. A child can come and touch that area that we were responsible to clean and it has to be clean, you know? So um, I've been out a lot and um, there's not a whole lot of people moving around too much. I'm sure you guys may have been, been to the grocery store or whatever, but what I'm gonna say is before we're let out of the house to just go about our lives, go back to everything, look inside, look, just look deep, deep inside. See everything that's in there, you know, is there any darkness in there? Work on it, let it go, blow it out, breathe in the light, of, of our source, our loving God, our creator, whatever you believe that is for you, breathe that in and blow out all the darkness, which I always say to you guys, but I mean it, it really works. Make sure you work on you inside. You know, you can do some guided meditations or whatever that means for you. Let go of some hatred or some, some hurt that you're holding on and anger towards someone. Before you step out, step in and just really look in there. Become a being of light because that's what we're meant to be. We're all meant to be beings of light, divine beings of light and beautiful energy, positive energy. And a lot of us aren't tapping into our gift that we've been given, you know, a gift of community, of of enjoying each other's energy, growing from each other's energy, being positive and enjoying life, you know, what does that look like? Because a lot of us have not been enjoying life. We've been stressed out and, and scared and terrified and we have to in this new normal, because this is gonna be the new normal, I have pretty much know that um what does that look like you know with happiness in it we have to live with happiness and live with purpose and with the world the way it is everything's different so the only person who you can be responsible for your happiness is you and it's like that anyway even if the world was all beautiful outside the only person that can be responsible is you for your happiness. You know, a man, any person will let you down. So I'll let you down, not intentionally, but uh, you know, people will let you down and they'll hurt you even if they don't mean to, you know. I mean, there's, I can't really think, my best friends, we've hurt each other, you know, little ways, you know, it just happens, but just, look inside and love yourself and and find happiness whatever that means like for me i'm growing my garden happiness is taking off i don't don't judge me <laughs> taking off my flip-flops and standing in the mud 
and just watering my plants and you know I do I take very good care of my feet <laughs> but I just like to feel connected to the earth I feel like to feel the energy it's the same at the beach I can't wait to get my feet in beach sand something about beach sand that just energizes me you know but then I like to lay on my hammock with this little booger Miss Feisty <laughs> yeah she's being shy today but anyway you know that's what makes me happy spending time with my kids today is my oldest daughter's birthday and I'm so so proud of her um, she's 23 years old and she's modeling um, she which I used to do that a long time ago but she just got accepted into uh, medical school in New Orleans and she's going to be a plastic surgeon she's been following shadowing one um, that he's been so kind to her for a couple years now and she got accepted into the school I'm just like so thrilled for her and her life and she's got the greatest guy ever oh my gosh he's so cute and sweet and adorable and he loves her so much and I'm so happy for her you know I can't believe it I was crying this morning I'm like you're now one year older than when I had you. <laughs> it's just a trip how fast it goes. So, can I get to pop sugar? You guys, I just love you. You know that. And, like, I want the best for myself and for all of you. And as I'm growing and learning on my journey, I'm going to share it with you. You know, it all started, and I'm just going to say real quick for those that don't know. <laughs> um... I'm not just some person who likes to give messages to people like I know everything or whatever. I, it's That's not the case. Um, I've been through some hard stuff in my life, which I'll share on another video again. But I had to have my whole jaw reconstructed. My every, This was broken. This was broken. I, you know, um, I was assaulted in, um, in a lot of different ways all at once and hurt really, really bad. And um, then I had to leave home at 14 because I was abused really badly. Um, and all the different things that have happened to me um, led me to be a motivational speaker and to help other women. And that's what I do. I have a nonprofit organization for those that don't know. It's called Empower Yourself Incorporated. And um, that's what we do. We help people, we help women house women coming out of um, substance abuse programs that do not have anywhere to stay, uh, that want to stay clean. The uh, substance abuse lady at the jail, she screens them before she calls me. Uh, and then the lady that I actually, that helped me in my day, it's when I was going through a horrible divorce and she was my rock. I get to work with her now um, and we help so many people. Um, it doesn't, it doesn't matter if you're homeless or whatever, and I employ them in my business. And so it's just been such a blessing. And I just want to pass it on to you. You know, I used to get into the makeup and stuff to cover my scars. And then I learned like, today I don't have any makeup on. I just have on some lip stuff and a, some little mascara. And I did my brows, but I don't have any foundation on or anything. But the point is, is when I first got into makeup, it was to hide all my scars. And, and now I'm like, I don't care, you know, my beauty comes from inside. So that's, that's why I started doing these empowering messages and sharing just the stuff I've learned with you guys. So now, you know, <laughs> you might be a little confused. Like, I just don't understand how box openings and advice go hand in hand, but in this world it does. So. Alrighty, my child scissors, because um, the kids have taken all of them. Listen, this box is always just so awesome. So let's get into it. We've got a box that I have to cut open first with baby scissors. Let's see what's in here. They always have the best stuff in this box. Now it is pricey, it's um, $89, $80. $89. Okay, this is a shell. Oh, okay. I think it's a set of bowls. From Canvas Home. It is. It's a set of bowls. And they're, they're really cool. 
some, there's like one cream, one blue and cream. Let me take this one out. There's two cream and then two blue and cream. I love this color too. Isn't it beautiful? These are so awesome. I love these. These are really nice. It's so funny. I've been using paper bowls lately because oh, I have so many children in my house right now during the, um, the, the lockdown. I don't know why I keep calling that the quarantine. And they're eating everything and using every paper product that you could possibly imagine. So, I mean, we bought a whole bunch of um, paper bowls. They're gone. Blackberry Apple Cider Digestive Awakening. Ooh with apple cider vinegar to support healthy digestion. I'm really happy to get this, even though I get tons of, of really special teas from Sipsby, which I'm gonna do that video like probably tomorrow. I'm, I have so much cool stuff to share with you guys. And I'm giving one away. Um, I'm giving a box away tomorrow. But anyway, this looks like it'll be really good. I love it. anything with apple cider vinegar. Okay, we have, what is this? The Art of Snore. Apparently, I've been a snore artist lately. Okay. Oh, these were a choice item, and I, yeah, it's a blue light filter um, glasses, and I can't get the box. <laughs> Everything is so hard to open lately. Jeez. Okay. Yeah, I chose these. I thought they were so cute. Aren't they cute? They're like clear cat eye. I love them. These are so awesome and they couldn't have come at a better time because they literally have broke the arm off of every pair of my reading glasses that I have. <laughs> so I have to, they sit lopsided. All right, what else do we have in here? Rebecca Minkoff. Ooh, this was, um, this is why I got my box so late. I thought this was a choice item, right? And I ended up putting it in my box. I'm like, Ooh, yes, the pink watch. <laughs> I'll choose that. Well, it was an add on and I ended up having to pay for it and got my box like a whole month late too. And it was crazy. They said it was going to drop off at the end, the very last day. It didn't, my, it charged my card for this plus the box. And this was like the same value as the box. It was like 76 bucks. I was really not too happy with myself not reading, um, you know, like a little more careful. <laughs> and then also being told wrong that it wasn't too cool. But it is a very, very pretty watch. It's this really light pink band, um, if you can, See the color too good i'm gonna wear the crap out of it it's very pretty but i wouldn't have purchased that right now if i had a choice <laughs> i thought i had a choice okay there's something uh, it's a smudge and a box um a box it's a little pouch and inside is all sort of crystals oh my goodness i love this pink quartz to meditate with blue agate this looks like tourmaline it looks like tourmaline oh well I can't find that one right now it's brown it's really pretty <laughs> this one is really cute I mean, this one's cool as heck. It looks like an ice cube. It's a crystal. That is so gorgeous. And then we have these um, here. And I'm, I don't know why it, my mind is going blank, but there's a place called Ballast Point, right? Geodes. And it's the geode capital of the world. It's right here in Tampa. And you can go there and there's just this giant big rocks all over at the end of a pier. Well, if you cut it open, it, it's all in, you know, the purple crystals inside. I mean, they're worth a fortune. It's so funny because there's just literally thousands and thousands of them down at the pier and you can get as many as you want. It's just try to cut one open. Yeah. 
<laughs> that won't happen. Um, I've tried, but we busted open with a hammer. Is <laughs> how we ended up getting it open, and it, and it just crumbled. It was it's so sad, but some of the pieces came out pretty. But yeah, if you know how to cut stone, you know, if you then, oh, and this was another choice. Uh, this is a necklace and it was so cute in the picture. Let's see, can I open it somehow? <sighs> okay. I'm off today, guys. <laughs> I hope you guys are all doing great. I'm feeling great. Isn't that cute? I have to, you know when stuff's kind of wonky when it's been in the package for a little bit? I have to kind of fix it, but this is really pretty. I don't know why, this reminds me of, of my friend Kim. She loves like bold stuff and this, this necklace reminds me of her. Um, what else do we have in here? Uh, Amora Vixa Magic Moisture Mist from Budapest. Ooh, cool. Again, gorgeous glass bottle. It's um, a hydrating mist. Let's see how it feels. It smells so good and it comes out really thin, like really light. It smells amazing. This is gonna be something I'm gonna be using all summer. Just the smell, oh my gosh. It smells like a spa. And then, let's see, what else do we have in here? We have Avocado Melt um, Retinol Eye Sleeping Mask Glow by Glow Recipe. I don't have um, I don't think I have any retinol cream for my eyes right now. I'm, us I'm using my uh, Rodin and Fields eye cream, but I like to put some, I always like to put a retinol on my face too. So this, this will be awesome. That's really awesome. It's funny, like you don't realize that you're out of something until like, you know, or until you see it sometimes. Now this is a good gift for me. <laughs> Sentiva Disinfecting Wipes. This is from Clorox. This one is Tuscan Lavender and Jasmine. This one is Bleach Free. It's got, oh, Coconut Breeze. And Tahitian Grapefruit Splash. These are so awesome. I wish I had a whole huge box of them this size. <laughs> okay. Well, that is it. That is it. This was, um, this was a good box. I, it's not, it, matter of fact, I like, listen, I like all this stuff in here and I'm not being crazy, but out of every pop sugar box I've gotten, this is the one that is like the least amazing. Usually like you, you get like clothes and and like a beautiful hat like especially in the spring and like a beautiful gorgeous like cover up and a beach towel and a you know I mean they they really put a lot of stuff in for the box and I'm, I'm not saying anything bad like the necklace is probably pricey and um the glasses and all that stuff I know the watch was because I had to pay for it <laughs> Let me see. Okay. Well, the spritz is $95. Ouch. Stop feisty. Why would you do that? Okay. The smudge wellness glow spell. This is, um, the crystals. They're set to reset, recharge, and reconnect you in a meaning, meaningful way. Crystals are believed to be helpful and beautiful tools in creating and reinforcing the intentions you want to set in your life. Um, let me tell you something. If you guys uh, work with crystals, um, make sure when the moon is full that you take your crystals and you put them in water and put a little, put a little bit of salt in there. Make some salt water with warm water so the salt will dissolve. 
put just a little salt, put your crystals in there and set them out in the sun under the full moon and recharge them and cleanse them because um, you use them just, it's really a, a tool to just keep your mind focused, but we use them to help us meditate on something that we want or meditate on something that we don't want. You know, we want to remove or if, if we're in massive pain, there's like all different reasons why we will grab something like that, you know, to, to help us, you know. And um, so you, sometimes the energy can be um, transferred onto things, you know. Um, negative energy, and energy never stops, let's put it that way. It just keeps going and going and going and changing and, and you know, going. And energy never stops. This energy right here, it's just going to just keep on going. <laughs> and, you know, it's hard to explain. But, um, yeah, I, uh, I have a person that has been a friend of mine, one of my very first friends on here, and I can't wait. I have so many things to send out to so many people. I haven't got to it yet. But, um, let's get back to this. I just wanted to give you a little thing about the crystals. The, the, the glasses, 50 bucks, 95 for that spray. So they're, okay, 50 for the um, crystals. Okay, the green one was fluoride, I was wrong. Agate was the brown one. Solidite, I didn't get that one. Amethyst is the geode, and then the rose quartz. Then we've got $42 for the eye cream. The necklace was $75. You could have chose it in this tan color or the blue. I chose the blue just because it's like, make my eyes come out. And then I guess the bowls are so you can put healthy food in them. <laughs> I've been like eating crap and putting on weight guys I've got to get on the ball I was doing the, the quarantine boot camps with the, my daughter and her friends and 